Hey guys, Omar with another quick tip here. Hope you're all doing well and enjoying your music production journey. I'm going to show you how to make creative percussive loops by chopping up multiple percussive loops. So what I like to do is I like to listen out for sounds that I enjoy in a loop. And what we're going to do is take the parts that we like and get rid of the rest and we're just going to create our own percussive loop like this and we're just going to slowly fill in the gaps so it's going to look something like this and we could even turn it into a new loop and then you know kind of change it up like this And we can even chop it up further and start pitching individual elements by double clicking. And that's how you get, you know, that cool kind of drum sound. So if I was to pitch all of this up by seven, it's also another good way to get a interesting percussive loop creatively and you get interesting percussive elements that sound outside the box and different and we can just chop up bits that we like so this has like a little bit of air just at the start of the sample and we could turn this into a rhythmic effect and now it will just fill out our loop a bit more again and add texture and colour you can hear that in the background and we can quickly get a really interesting sound that sounds cool and creative. And guys, be sure to check out Music Work for Academy for top templates, sample packs and more. Thanks for listening guys. I'll speak to you next one. Peace.